Okay, I'm going to show you how to turn assignments in on Google Classroom. So here I am, I'm logged in as Jaslyn, and I, I'm here in the classroom. I can see new assignments here in the stream, but I'm going to go, if you look at the top, over here to classwork, because this is where all of my assignments are. I'm going to go down to science. Here's the science assignment, and I think what a lot of people are doing is just clicking on the video and then leaving their comment. What you want to actually do is go into the assignment, which you either do if you if it says view assignment at the bottom, you can do it that way, or you can click up here. I always look for the circle with a clipboard, but you can see how it turns blue when I'm hovering over it. That whole bar. Okay, here I am. So I go, I click on the video, I watch the video, and then I'm ready to respond. And I have a couple of options. If I look over here, I go to the Add or Create button. And I can create a new document. Or if I already have a document that I've written that I want to attach, I can do that. So if I wanted to, if I had written another document that I want to attach, I click on Google Drive. And then it connects to my Google Drive and I find my document. Um, I've already made a paragraph for Jaslyn to attach. So she would click on this, click add, and then turn in. The other way to do it, if you haven't already written something separately, you click on add or create, you go down. I want to write a document, so I click on docs, and it creates or generates a document already with the correct title. As soon as it's done, it pops up in another window. Um, on my computer, the pop-ups are blocked, so now I have to click on it. Here, I type my document. This is what I learned about nests and why birds nest in the spring. I say, Birds. Actually, first need to put my name, date, and subject. Name, Jaslyn, date, 4, 28, 20. The subject is science. I don't know why there's a Q in the middle of it. I hit tab. There are have you ever wondered why birds nest in the spring? It turns out there are several reasons. First of all, there is more food to feed the babies. Furthermore, babies have longer to grow before winter. And then I click turn in. It asks me if I want to turn it in. I say yes, I want to turn it in. And there you have it. Document turned in. If she decides she wants to change something, she can click unsubmit, and then she gets the document back. What about... Okay, what about those assignments where you don't need to turn something in? So, here I am in classwork again, and there are things that are assignments. I'm looking to see if I can find one that's missing. They turn red when they're missing. <laughs> um, okay, so for the bad seed, imagine, actually, let's do um, opinion. Oh, she's already turned it in. Okay, I'll go to this one. If I go to the bad seed assignment, Now I can click on view assignment 
And if it's done, but I took my notes in my notebook, so I don't have to turn anything in because I have them in my notebook, I just click mark as done. And it says you didn't attach any work and you're like, that's good. I got it in my notebook. If you wanted to attach work, then you would do what um, I just showed you, add or create. If you wrote your notes separately, you would go to Google Drive and attach your notes that way.